Hi Mavs fans. We want to thank you very much for all of your support last season and this summer. We appreciate all of you very much. We also want to tell you some of the fun things we have coming up this summer. First of all, we'll be open throughout the summer. Wednesdays and Thursdays will be open 11 to 7, and Fridays and Saturdays will be open 11 to 5. If you haven't been in the store in a while, make sure you stop by to check out all of our new summer items. We have men and women polos, different styles of shorts, tank tops, t-shirts, car shades, and much more. We also have a Facebook and a Pinterest for the team store, and we're going to put up new deals every week, so make sure you follow that closely. And then also, we have our team store website up and running, so be sure and check that out. We're also excited to tell you about something new we're doing this summer. It's called Mavs Fashion Tuesday. We'll be interviewing someone different each week associated with the Mavs and asking them questions about fashion and more. Be sure to check us out on Facebook. Hi Mavs fans, welcome to our first episode of MFT Mavs Fashion Tuesday. We are going to see if I can get Mr. Thiessen to give me a quick interview. Let's see what he's doing. I'm so fancy. Okay, are you ready for this? These may be the most difficult questions that you've ever had to answer as in your position, but here we go. All right, first question. I know that you recently hired a new coach, but the girls in the team store actually were hoping to give you a list of their top three candidates. However, since you've already chosen a coach, they would still like to know if you had to choose one of the three following fashion forward guys as your coach, who would it be? Here are your choices. Zach Efron, <laughs> Channing Tatum, or Vin Diesel? I think I'd have to go with, uh, with Zach Efron at this point uh, because I think um, our, our population of females uh, at the games would certainly increase. Um, nothing against uh, Rich, but um, Zach probably would uh, would draw more of the female fan base. So uh, I think out of those three, Zach is probably a little bit uh, more popular at this stage, in my opinion. Okay, great. All right. Which of the guys in the office has the best fashion sense? Todd Mackin, without a doubt. He... Uh, um, you know, he has several nicknames and, uh, you know, he's always good for a laugh in the, in the staff meetings. Um, the amount of product I think that he uses, uh, on a daily basis is, uh, probably keeping a lot of stores in business. So uh, without a doubt, Todd Mackin. Okay, great. Would you care to, to comment on who has the least fashion sense? Oh, Greg Bergen by far. <laughs> Um, you know, both in the same department, I think, uh, you know, you, you go from one extreme to the other. Um, you know, Greg is, uh, Greg's the old man in the office. You know, he's, uh, he's very simple. Uh, and, uh, you know, you, you always know what you get with him. With Todd, it's, it's always an adventure and you never know what he's going to show up in. Okay, good stuff. All right. What is your fashion pet peeve? Uh... What's my fashion pet peeve? I think, um, boy, you're asking the wrong person this question. Um, I would have to say um, if you don't match your socks uh, to your pants, uh, that's, that's probably uh, a pet peeve of mine. Um, although uh, I think Todd breaks that rule every day with his, uh, with his fashion statements. Okay. Um, what size shoe do you wear and what is your favorite pair of shoes? Uh, well, I, I wear dress shoes a lot. So Cole Haan dress shoes, I think are, are, are my favorite. Um, I'm a size 12, so Great. nothing too exciting there. Okay. Um, what color do you look best in? Blue for sure. I agree. Uh, and I would say that that, uh, uh, is, is probably the, the color I have most of. Okay, on a scale of 1 to 10, with 10 being the best, how do you think your teenagers would rate your style? A 1. <laughs> a 1. Yeah, I don't, uh, there's, a big, there's a big gap there, uh, that's for sure. I don't, I don't think that they would be very proud of my style. Okay, and last question before the speed round. Which NL team, past or present, has the best colors or logo? Which NL team? NHL. NHL so team. Sorry. NHL. Um, which NHL team has the best logo or colors? Oh, I think the Blackhawks. Chicago Blackhawks have a, a very traditional logo that uh, 
uh, hasn't been tweaked or changed much, and, and obviously an original six team, they've uh, a lot of history and tradition. I think that that's probably the that red, black, and white is is pretty sharp. I think uh, a lot of people would agree they've got the best logo. Now it's time for the speed round. Are you ready for this? Yes. Okay. Favorite number? 19. Favorite color? Green. Golf or swimming? Golf. Striped socks or plaid socks? That's a Todd question. Mike and Ike or hot tamales? Mike and Ike's, although they used to have those bubblegum ones uh, that I don't think you can find anymore. Mike and Ike's. Dr. Dre or Snoop Dogg? I'm going to have to go with the dog. Snoop Dogg. <laughs> Apples or oranges? Apples. Lemonade or iced tea? Lemonade for sure. I think that's all I have with my interview with Brent. Thank you for tuning in and join us next week when we will be interviewing Bob Renison and asking him about some important fashion questions. Make sure you come and visit us this week at the team store and here are our weekly specials this next week. I'm so fancy.